In this lecture, we are moving to multiple regression analyze. Before we start, make sure you are comfortable with doing simple regression and reading the results. To do a multiple regression, we still use process reg. The difference is we are putting more than one explanatory variable in the model. So instead of writing rental rates equals H, we put another one, which is operating expense in the model. So what you want to do is add behind this H operating expenses. All right, now it has two explanatory variable, make it a multiple regression. So again, execute this, check the logs, everything is fine. So let's see the result. We can notice there we have a number far smaller than our rule of thumb, which is 5%, right? So this number is much smaller. Then it is saying that our model is valid. Then we examine the R square. It has gone up from 6% to 37%. Huge improvement, huh? Now, Let's put all four explanatory variables here and see how do they work out. Execute this. Mm -hmm. Looks good, no problem. I see the result. The model is still valid and the R squared is nearly 58%, which is pretty high now. So you can see the model is doing more accurate than before we have like just a simple regression analysis, right? Now another thing here is you can see there's an adjusted R squared. Actually, in multiple regression, this number is more appropriate to take. So when you are seeing how is the model doing, it's preferred that you say this adjusted R square instead of the original R square. So that's all for this lecture. We'll talk more about this result in the next lecture. Bye.